This is such a unique time to be living in, in quarantine. Social distancing to limit the spread of COVID-19. It's a period that'll be written in history books for sure. In my lifetime, we can look back at so many notable events, and this is certainly among the most significant. We'll study its economic and social impact on the world for years to come. But as we're in the middle of it, I wanted to remember this moment. Looking back, what was the typical day like of following orders and sheltering in place? How did we keep busy? What was it like with kids? Well, this is one day with our family during a pandemic. I noticed you the other day, but I'm so awkward, I just walked the other way. Mornings start around 7.30, which is pretty great. We have good sleepers. Our deal is Katie handles the baby in the middle of the night while I get the kids in the morning to get them ready. Personally, I love it. He's <laughs> being silly, huh? <laughs> I love that baby gate. Up until recently, we'd actually just been putting chairs in front of the stairs. These, as a blockade, but we finally grew up and got baby gates. Yes, the baby gear reviewer took forever to get baby gates. And the morning goes on. I get the boys fed, I get myself ready, brush up, get dressed. Yes, I like to wear my normal daily clothes uh, to get in that right headspace. People joke about staying in pajamas all day. I just can't do that. Why you smell like poop at 8.15? Some days Colin will have beaten me to a morning dump, so it's diaper change round two. In the meantime, Katie usually makes the bed and is getting ready as well. Then Henry is checking the weather. It's gonna be sunny. It's gonna be sunny? Yeah, it's gonna be sunny today. Woo, that's exciting. Are you sure you didn't have your vitamins yet? I didn't. No? Okay. Let's get some. Let's get some? Yep. Alright, let's go get some vitamins for you. Can you see your mouth? Ah. Okay, good. Here you go. Here's the last one. Thank you. What's wrong? I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'm just gonna take off your pants. What are you doing? Hey. What are you doing? Just before nine, I stock up on my own vitamins and then I go check on Katie and then she taps in. <laughs> and it's off to the races. I go to my office and start my work day. Let's see, Andrew. Hey, I'm here. Morning. From about nine to four every day, I'm here. Those are the hours I've set for myself. Sometimes I wrap up at three, sometimes it's at five, it's fluid. My company in particular is operating at a 25% pay cut, which does hurt, but I am grateful to have a job that does keep me busy. Now, this is where I get to gloat about my wife. Is that the flag house? Ow. Psh, that, my friend, is a helicopter. Psh, or an airplane. <laughs> While I'm working, she's the one watching after our boys. She's the one figuring out the next activity and really dealing with the highs and lows. It's only 9.54. Got a little bit of the day ahead of us. She's active with them. She's playing games. She's putting in online orders. Yes, of course there's screen time. Disney Plus take the wheel. If I review something, it's often a product she came across or suggested. She's stressed. She says that she feels ugly and that she's not doing enough. All I have to say about it is, Katie, you are perfect. I couldn't do this without you. Around 12.30, Colin will wake up from his lovely two hour nap. So we're gonna go get him. Hi, buddy. For now, I'm gonna have lunch with you and then um, we'll hang out for a little bit and then I'll go back to work. Is that okay? Seems like one of our four uh, Purell things are running out now. But not to fear because we have this. Katie was able to get this from a grocery store, get her hands on it, and it looks like straight up alcohol. It's from a local distillery because they make hand sanitizer now. So do you, do you just like- You make your own hand sanitizer with the rubbing alcohol, um, aloe vera and essential oil. Oh. So yeah, I'll grab lunch and then it's back to work. Meanwhile, Katie planned out a drive along scavenger hunt and then ended up- Waiting at Target for my pickup order. I have one sleepy boy. The only time he ever naps these days is when we're in the car, so I'll take it. 
It's like the one time I can listen to a podcast is when he's asleep. Normally it's crime junkies. I'm all about the true crime, but I'm listening to Nick Vile. She wasn't going to have an overnight on The Bachelor? Yeah. Um, I. Henry. You want some lunch, Betty? Mm -hmm. We're home. We, we went to Target already. You slept through it. No, I want to go to Target. We didn't go inside. We just stayed in the car. Still in jammies at, at 2.30. Still in jammies. We'll probably be in them until bath time tonight. And then we'll just put on a new pair of jammies, so. As the day goes on, Katie keeps them entertained and active, but they do start to progressively get bugged. Did you take the phone away from your brother? Yeah. Are you gonna share with him? Also, Henry's refusal to take naps leads to minor breakdowns, and if Katie's taking too much heat, that's when I'll step in. You're just being mean to mommy, I don't want you to be mean to mommy, okay? So when you're done crying, I'll let you just cool off. When you're done, when you're done crying, and you're ready to be happy, you can go out to mommy, okay? okay? You let me know when you're ready to go back out, okay? I need to go potty. You need to go potty? Yeah. Okay. Now, on days that I'm lucky, I might be able to squeeze in some dad verb work. For this particular day, I'm setting up a baby monitor to test that was requested by you, the viewers. Oh, nice. You know, the thing that a lot of people don't understand about making all these reviews is that I don't just like set it up and then make a video. Like I take a long time to gather my thoughts and script and bullet point it, get a comprehensive idea of what this is all about for you guys. And then I shoot the A roll, then I take the time to shoot the B roll and light it appropriately and all that stuff. And the cutting and the editing is like at least 10 hours. So when people ask like, just review this, just review that, like it's actually not possible for me just because I try to make reviews at a higher level. And also I have to balance that higher standard that I that I have for myself with actual work that I have to do for my job. So at the moment, I have to be really selective and infrequent with what I review, but maybe that'll change if I'm able to go full time one day. I don't know, we'll see. I had to move the monitor to this room. It's a lot better here. Okay. Yeah, he's being quiet. Okay, so Colin's not sleeping, which means we're probably not gonna get a workout, so we all might just do family walk, and then we gotta figure out dinner. Ugh. You know what I want to do for dinner tonight? What do you want to do for dinner? Chick-fil-A. We j or, or order a pizza. We've like barely done that. We've never done that. I know. Since all of this COVID stuff started, we have not once gone out to eat. We've relied on all the groceries that we stocked up on and just cooked and cooked and cooked we, every we single it. meal, every single day. But I think today might be the day that we cave and actually do pick up. It might be, up. honestly. <laughs> We're gonna go on a walk, and we might as well get some B-roll footage. Let's see if this works. There we go. There he is. Let's see, walk around, how do you feel? Bless you. Sometimes we work out, sometimes we walk. On this day, we're shooting B-roll for yet another review. The work-life work balance is skewed, but my wife's patience with me deserves an award. We come home and chill, and as promised, we get that Chick-fil-A. Katie? I'll pick it up the Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Here you go. Enjoy a family dinner in our backyard and FaceTime with some family because why not? And it, it actually feels great right now. We're, we're under our little covered patio, but. No, it's sunny today. And then the rest of the night is autopilot. It's chill time, then bath time. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, little guy. We get both boys ready for bed. We play some more. It might be a board game, a movie, or basketball. This is my chance as a dad to recoup that time that I lost earlier at work. By seven, Colin is the first to go down, and then Henry stays up a bit longer. On this night, we play video games. It's Mario Odyssey. Mm. You want to play that one? Okay, we'll play that one. Yes! Have you won? Mario! High five, Mario! Look, what are we gonna get? A trophy! We're gonna get a trophy! One more, and after we go nine nights. Okay. Henry will go down around 8-ish. 98% of the time, he'll want Katie to put him down, but 
He's getting better about me reading to him at night, so that's nice. After, Katie and I will do a quick clean of the house, get things picked up and organized, and then it's my favorite part of the day. I get to chill with my best friend. On this night, we watch Survivor, we'll do this till late, we'll dick around on our phones in bed, we'll fall asleep, and then repeat. Thank you.